Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how you can recover any permanently deleted video or photo that has been already deleted from the Photos app. So as you can see, now I have this Photos Plus app. This is the app that we are, we are going to use to recover the photos and videos. But this is not going to like Photos and then scrolling down, go to Recently Delete and Recovering from here. This is not this, okay? This is a new method that will allow you to recover any photo or video that has been already deleted from this folder, okay? As you know, um, it, this will stay here for 29 days, but after that, this will be permanently removed from my phone. So now I'm gonna show you how you can remove those photos or videos that were already removed from there. So for, now, for this, we are gonna use Photos Plus. This is an app that it's not available on the App Store, but I'm gonna show you in this video how to install it, super easy, don't worry. But first of all, let me show you how this works, okay? So when you open Photos Plus app, uh, you will see this. And all you need to do is just press or tap on tab recover here. And this will start like scanning your device for the cache memory. As you know, we have like different memories on our phone. And basically when one of those photos or videos get removed permanently, this doesn't get really removed from our phone. This will stay there for like months or even one year until uh, the cache gets cleared. So this will scan that memory and it's very useful because as you can see, it has found 178 videos and photos. And now all you need to do is just tap on recover and this will start recovering all the photos and videos directly on your gallery. So you need to wait now and those photos or um, videos will be recovered and saved on your gallery, okay? So that's how I've done it. Uh, it works very well. And now I'm gonna show you how to install this Photos Plus app, okay? So to do this, what you're gonna do is, first of all, um, go on settings on your phone. Now you need to scroll down, okay? Now go to battery. And now make sure that the low power mod, it's turned it off like this, okay? So this is because we are going to install this app, not through the App Store, but through a browser extension. And that's why this is required. If you have the low power mode, uh, turn it on, you will see the yellow battery. In this case, just go here and disable this. All right, so now let's install the Photos Plus app. And to do so, we need to open Safari. And now we need to go to the official website of the developers of this app, which is basically uh, tap tweak, tap tweak dot com okay this is the website so just go here and now here you need to tap on search and just type here photos like this now you will see the photos plus app here and to install it just tap on it one time now tap on the green button start injection and then you will see this will automatically connect with your phone and will automatically download and install this photos plus app so you don't need to do anything. Basically, this will create a browser extension that will be installed on your home screen. And after that, you will see the icon there and you will be able to just run it and use it to recover your permanently deleted photos and videos on any iOS device. So let's just wait and then we shall see a confirmation page here. So you can see it's this page. But very important, if it's your first time accessing TapTweak, they will see your iPhone will be new to the website and to prevent bots on any of those things, you'll see a blue page with two apps here. And that's totally normal. I have already done that. What you're going to do is just install both apps and complete the instructions. The apps are from the Play Store or App Store, and you need to just uh, install it and then follow the instructions. They will be like running for 30 seconds or something like that, okay? All right, so now when you see this, uh, this screen, you can just close this and on your home screen, you will see the Photos Plus app installed. Now, all you need to do is just run it and you will see this will open. Now, to recover your photos or videos, just go ahead, press on recover, and now you will be able to recover any permanently deleted photos or videos on your iPhone or iPod. And that's it, guys. I hope this tutorial has been useful. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and see you in the next video. Peace.